हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी इन्फ्लुएंस लाइन डायग्राम फॉर सपोर्ट रिएक्शन नाउ फॉर फाइंडिंग द इन्फ्लुएंस लाइन डायग्राम फॉर सपोर्ट रिएक्शन वी नीड टू कंसीडर अ सिंपली सपोर्टेड बीम ए बी ऑफ लेंथ कैपिटल एल व्हिच इज शोन हियर ओके अ यूनिट लोड इज मूविंग फ्रॉम लेफ्ट टू राइट व्हिच इज शोन हियर दैट इज वन किलो न्यूटन लोड Now for finding the support reaction, we need to use the equilibrium condition. That is, summation of all the forces in the vertical direction is equals to zero. So we had written summation of V equals to zero. Now V A and V B are the reaction which is acting in the upward direction, and one kilo newton load is acting in the downward direction. So equation will become V A plus V B is equals to one kilo newton. Now second equilibrium condition will be moment about A equals to zero. From B, we will get equation as minus V B into L. Minus is because of anti-clockwise movement plus one into x because of clockwise movement. So V B will be equals to x by L. On putting the value of V B in equation one, we will get V A equals to L minus x upon L. Now this value of V A and V B is valid for the range of x between zero to capital L. Okay, students. now for the plotting of influence line diagram for support reaction we need to use the end conditions here at x equals to 0 if we will put x equals to 0 in the equation of va then it will becomes 1 and if we will put x equals to 0 in vb then it will be 0 similarly if we put x equals to l in va then its value will be equals to 0 And if we put x equals to l in V B, then its value will be equals to one. And if we put x equals to l by two, then V A will be equals to one by two. Similarly, V B is equals to one by two. Now, for plotting the influence line diagram for support reaction at A, what will be the value at x equals to zero? V A will be equals to one. So we had made here one. At x equals to l. V A will be equals to zero, and at x equals to l by two, V A will be equals to one by two, and all the equations is varying linearly. So we had made a straight line here, and in the equation of V A, the slope is negative, that is minus slope. So the graph will be like this, and that will be the influence line diagram for support reaction at A. now for the plotation of influence line diagram for support reaction at b at x equals to 0 vb will be equals to 0 at x equals to l vb will be equals to 1 and at x equals to l by 2 vb will be equals to 1 by 2 and it is a linear equation and its slope is positive because of this positive sign so graph will be formed like this and that variation is known as influence line diagram for support reaction at b here conclusion from molar breslau theorem is written that is to draw the ild for reaction at support lift the beam by unit amount at that support and corresponding reflected shape is the ild for that support now according to the molar breslau theorem if we want to plot the influence line diagram for support reaction at a we need to lift the support a by unit amount and the resulted deflected shape will be the ild for the reaction at a now if we want to plot the influence line diagram for reaction at b then we need to lift the support b by unit amount and the deflected shape will be the ild for support reaction at b that is all about the influence line diagram for support reaction thank you very much students